We got some custom windshield washer fluid. It's a 60 clear, pretty quality stuff. And uh, <clears throat> you know, I got the racy wiring harness. I mean, the <clears throat> extra strong tube. And uh, you got, you know, we got the train horns on this thing, but we only use that when the ladies come out of the closet. Um, I'm moving on to the inside of the vehicle. Alright, moving on to the inside of the vehicle. We got a 10 speed. Uh. <laughs> and, uh, you know, we got some, uh, energy drink was sponsored by Rockstar. So, you know, that's already, that's cool. We got some blankets when it's time to cuddle. It's time to cuddle, you already know. Uh, I got a, I got that, uh, Pro 510 XL CB radio. Not sponsored, by the way. I wish they'd sponsor me. Um, you know, I got a picture of the lady right there because, you know, you got respect. I got some lipstick, you know, because a good knife right here. Don't tell anybody. Um, what else we got? Oh, we got, um, we got, oh, my turbo gauge is actually at the shop right now. I actually have a nitrous in this thing, but, um, it's actually at my buddy Rico's house. Yeah, we can't show you that shit on YouTube anyways. Yeah, because that's, that's illegal. Uh, and, uh, oh, and apparently, um, I like to slash people's tires, uh, so people say. And, uh, I just like to say that's not true. And, uh, you know, just, I don't do that. that that's just disrespectful. You know, in here, we got a couple of Bryce's candy bars that I, uh, he bought the other day. He forgot here, but I'm a good friend, so I'm not going to eat them. Oh, you're one. No. <laughs> Oh, those are prices. Come on, that's so mean. Um, you know, we got some uh, more Rockstar. Um, another one. Got some Mountain Dew because, uh, you know, I'm trying to get sponsored by that. Just riding scooters and stuff. Um, and, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, I got this um, walkie-talkie so I can just tell the cops not to pull me over because I'm Tanner Phelps and I'm cool, you know. Um, so, uh, move on to the back. I can't actually show you too much detail because, you know, my vehicle is just so huge. I got a good color, just in case. Got some uh, spare parts over here. Uh, got some uh, general brand uh, trays. Uh, that we got a Goodwill for five bucks. Um, got two you know, 72 inch fucking subwoofers. Yeah, we got some 72 inch by 24 inch uh, plasma screen uh, subwoofers. These things hit harder than your dad on Sunday when you don't go to church with them, all right? Um, and like you know, I got I just got I got some fire starters just in case. Got some matches just because I'm just prepared. And uh, you already know, I, I ain't gotta say words about this. Uh, you know, we got a ratchet strap because we're always working on shit. Uh, we got some electrical tape because I'm an electrical engineer. You already know. And uh, that's about it for the back. You know, I got the roof rack up here. Uh, to haul all the stuff, it, I haul, you know I'm hauling all the time. Um, and uh, you have to look at 10 foot, 10 foot thing of a jigger. Um, and all right, you have to, we'll start, we'll start here with the uh, stickers. All right, so we got the uh, the classic retro HRS sticker. That's highly collectible, not as collectible as the other one. I'll show you that in a minute. We got the RDM, that stands for Rain Don't Matter. Alright, and then we got the new and improved HRS logo, the T4R.org. You know what that is? That's a big group of us Toyota 4Runners owners that we just like to meet up and, you know, just Check to the rock. swing and swing. Coming on to the other side, you know, you know I'm all muddy because, you know, I'm just out slinging mud everywhere I go. Alright, you got the highly collectible limited edition. There's only seven of these in the world, alright? HRS Gold Platinum Edition. All right, you know I got that Bill Steed. It came with my four hundred thousand dollars shocks that I got on here. Makes it feel like you're riding a Cadillac. I got the shocker, you know, because that's just that's just my generation's peace sign. I just got to represent. And then we got the Forerunner Nation with the tree with the mountains in the back. And uh, moving on to my mirrors, I got the custom G forty five X two thousand mirrors. And uh, yeah, you already know that that's just helps me see people when they try to pass me but they can't and uh, you know I got the turbos I got the two turbos, extra turbos. Um, I actually have a, I just can't see it because the hood's up and uh, it actually has a uh, turbos on top and blow off valves it's got the whole nine yards because you already know it's a 3,400 horsepower vehicle 
And it's 10 speed, so that's good too. And moving on to my tires, I actually got the drift slicks, and uh, my uh, 44 inch MTs are um, actually home. They're actually out back, so. And then on the back, you know, they got a little bit more tread just because, you know, you gotta have a little bit more tread for burnouts, otherwise you'll blow them up. And uh, coming on my uh, gas cap thing, uh, it's it's very, very custom. I mean, like, these things, they only made 12 of these in the entire United States. But um, you can get them in like Japan and stuff. You have to get them imported. And they come off the skylines. I mean, it's just pretty insane. But these these things are twenty two thousand dollars new, and you already know like they're just you that that's custom right there. And and the last and final thing, I got the sexy forerunner banner to let everybody know who just passed them. And uh, that's about it for the vehicle tour. You guys already we got, know? We got yeah. two more turbos down here. Yeah, those are, uh, those are the quad turbos. I was going to say that next. And, uh, yeah, guys, that's about it. And, uh, we'll get off to fixing my life bar in just a moment. Alright, welcome. Welcome to the Tanner's Custom Vado Auto Shop. Uh, this is my, uh, 3,400 horsepower Toyota 4Runner. 4 cam, 24, 24 stands for 24 bitches that I can fit in here, it's real nice. Um, it's all my uh, custom wiring, you know, because I'm, I'm, I'm an electrical engineer. Alright, well, uh, this is uh, some fluid right here, you know, it's all good. We got a ground with a little bit of uh, battery acid on there, just for when I want to trip balls at the parties. Um, we got a handful of wiring right here because light bars are a necessity, and uh, we got some fucking more light, want more wiring. And today we're going to be fixing this light bar because you know, I like off road to like to the max until shit breaks, right? So this time some shit broke. So I gotta fix the wiring on the light bar. All right, so what you have to do is you have to get two 10 inch ratchet sockets, all right? And uh, so you're gonna have to come over here with your ratchet sockets. Mine are right down here, so like, I'm not gonna show you that part, but I think you're gonna get down here lay down, get up all underneath here, and uh, get it all ratcheted up. Oh, oh that's 600 pounds, got it strong. And, all right, so here's the most important part, all right? Here, hand me the camera. All right, so in order to make this work, what you have to do is you have to go like this. Bang, 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 bang. Come over to the other side, bang, Go like that, and then boom, on. It's all good. You know I got those halos because I drive a freaking Beamer. Yeah, it's hot. All right. Fuck, that's hot. And uh, so that's how to fix your light bar on any vehicle, any type of light bar, any sort of wiring. You don't even have to plug it in. All you have to do is just hit the lights, and then just swipe that Toyota, and then you'll be good to go. All right, thank you. Cameron? Alright guys, we're out here in the auto shop. We got our boy Andre here representing Cameron is performing surgery on the coal roller. And uh, what we're going to be doing today is um, some customization, muffler delete, and uh, yeah. Pretty high quality tools, but only the professionals get up in here. This is how this is how it goes, folks. Fuck me. Do not try this at home. Yeah, you try it. Try this at home. Yeah, try it at home for sure. Do it to your daddy's Ferrari. Yeah, yeah. Do it to your daddy's Ford. <laughs> Just make sure you uh, cut that suspension. <laughs> That's how it goes, folks. 
You saw it here? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, now all we gotta do is just click a toe strap to it, uh, get the forearm going about 80 in the other direction, and it'll just rip right off. That's all we need to do. Alright? Until the next one. I'm feeling Peace. it. Alright, we got Andre's Forerunner. It's a lot like mine, but you know, it's got the pretty it's shoes nice. on. Pretty shoes, but the, the block lift. And alright, so Andre has his first sticker on here. You already know it's the HRS one. We got a bumper in the making, too. Yeah, he's making, that, he's making that custom eBay bumper. Alright, we got Cameron. You guys actually missed it, but we ended up supercharging it. It just took us like three hours. And uh, blow off valves are coming in the mail. And yeah, it's pretty, pretty tits. Cameron, how do you feel about your new supercharger? Yeah, that sounds nice, doesn't it? Supercharger. We can't pop the hood because uh, we actually ended up breaking the hood uh, hinges, so we can't actually show you the motor. But it's just, it's bigger than the freaking, bigger, bigger than Cameron. Not surprising, huh? And you know, Cameron's got that that shocker sticker you know 60 extra horsepower right there and uh that's it